What's up, beautiful people? Thanks for tuning in. I appreciate you. You know I do. Caro, Caro, Caro. Welcome back for another video. My girl. <laughs> so I am going to do a pearl set on my hair. A little different. We're going to try to switch it on up. Um, I don't think I have enough orange rods. I feel like it used to fill this whole bag up. And now I don't know where they are. So we are risking it all to use the orange rods. So this hairstyle is gonna be more like a formal look, you know, cause I am going out about tonight, you know. They don't look cute. <laughs> okay, so that's what we're gonna do. Nothing new, we're gonna be playing games. Look, I need this to be successful and I know this works for my hair. So this is the combo. How about this? If you're in your feelings about it, like that, y'all are using the same stuff, I get it. Go ahead down below and let me know your favorite combo for a perm rod set, okay? Let your girl know. Um, but I like this one because it is affordable. So this is a lot of body wrap me foaming mousse. And then um, I wouldn't say that this is affordable, but I like it for my hair, uh, which is the Myel Organics Pomegranate Honey Leave-In Conditioner. The other alternative is to use the Cream of Nature Mango and Butter, is it called? Mango and Shea Butter Ultra Moisturizing Leave-In Conditioner. And yeah, girl, so let's get this video started. Oh, girl, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. I always want to focus on everything else, but what I'm asking it to do. All throughout my hair. Put some on the ends, and then that's when we go inside the hair, okay? For the rest of it, within the rest of the hair, okay? I actually like to do perm rod sets on wet hair just because I personally feel like they set better. But doing it out, doing it on the blown out hair, stretched hair, it all works. But I personally like it on wet hair. I don't like the drying time, you know, sitting on the dryer and all that. But you know, it still works, you know. But yeah, so if you're new to the channel, welcome. Uh, my name is Janae. Uh huh. You can call me Nay or Nay Nay. Okay, girl, girl, girl. Whichever way you want to approach me and you see me out and about, it works. All of it works. And so, um, typically with my rod sets, if you um, are new, I like to two strand twist at the root. Now, you know, you got a lot of terms out here twist and curl, perm rod, you know. So basically, you'll see my approach and think it's a twist and curl, but it's not. It's like his cousin from down the street. You know, I'm not going all the way down with the twist. I'm stopping like just, I'm only going down a little ways just so that I have a little bit of stretch at the roots. Twist, twist, twist. I'm stopping. I'm smoothing. Holding that real, real tight. Grab that rod. Now I'm adding the rod. Cut it down. Put that in, I'm gonna go up. Now all the way to the root, we're gonna stop so there'll be a little hang time, cause I need a little hang time for this. Okay. One, two, three, like four twists down. Maybe like four or three twists down. Get that ride. These are actually like, these were like my favorite rides and then I started like in the pink ones. That's probably why I got more pink than orange, but I think somebody stole my rides. Uh -huh. I'm convinced. Now who was still alive? I don't know. Maybe my mama. I need to talk to her. Water is just dripping. Does anybody love that when you're doing your hair? Just water going everywhere on your face and just like delaying things for you. Do you like that? Let me know. I don't. <laughs> Don't. Perfect.
All right, y'all, so for the, the perimeter of my head, um, so if you have like super sensitive edges or anything like that, I would suggest for you to flat twist if you can, um, just so that it's not pulling too much on your hair if you wanna do it like that, or you can um, just do a regular two strand twist. So I know a lot of you all, if you don't like to two strand twist at the root, if you think that's weird or something, um, I would say at least do it around this area, okay? And the back, okay, of your head. Okay, it's sensitive right here, y'all. Ain't trying to lose the edges. So I'm gonna let my hair dry a little bit longer, y'all. Kinda mad I took down the front. Don't take down the front. That's not the best suggestion. Don't watch what I just did. You should never test the front. Especially the front that got a show. So I'll be back. Probably with my makeup done at this point. Okay, bye bye Makeup is on. Um, if it does not match, don't come for me. Um, I'm not a makeup guru. Anywho, so, girl, um, I'm going to take this down and we're gonna go from there. And yeah, you can hear the dryer, thanks. Yeah, forgot about that. <laughs> so, you know, Janae's getting better with makeup. We're, we're trying here. But yeah. Okay, hair. Let me put it back in the bag. I'll thank myself for putting it in the bag. So now it's time to separate and so I like to grab oil, okay, uh, when I am separating my curls. Now I did not show what oil I used, but it was the Melanin Hair Care Multi-Purpose Multi-Use Oil. Um, and I like to separate that section in half, right? And then per section that I created, uh -huh, I separate that about five times, y'all. You really want to take your time with separating. This gives you the best results, especially if you are about to go somewhere. You just got to go all out, okay? So just keep separating and separating and separating. Do not give up. Um, if you want to play some music to distract you, go ahead and do that. But I really take my time. And also, too, you know if you're twirling, twir can't even say the word, you know if you are twirling in the right direction, if that curl bounces back with no problem. Now, if it bounces back weird, then you just got to twirl the other way. And now this is what my hair is looking like. Look at that bounce. I love that combo for my hair. All right, so now it's time to fluff. You know how I like to fluff from the bottom and then working my way up, basically going in the shape of the hairstyle. Now 
now it's time to mix it up a little bit um i ended up pulling both of those sides up as you saw me do quickly i just never showed it on camera so i do apologize in advance but the same way i did this side of my head i did it on the opposite side as well now this right here this edge layer by this brand mm -mm. i put it on my edges it was looking good at the beginning y'all but you will see later like it just loosened up for some reason it turned straight into oil um and so i had to end up using another edge control right on top just so that i can keep my edges slicked down so after doing that holding it and kind of twisting it as if you would do like a what they used to call it like a twist twist back in the day um and then i use a bobby pin to secure it i always try to use two bobby pins and with those two bobby pins i like to create an x so yeah like the letter x and like i said got upset that the <laughs> edge control did not lay correctly so added some more to really secure that down and yes i love um deodorant so if y'all see my deodorant just go ahead and just be okay with that <laughs> but yeah so after doing that i did do the other side i just did not show that on camera but i did lay down my edges and i let that sit all the way up until like i walked into the venue y'all gotta keep the edges laid down as long as we can and then this is like two days later um it shows how i slept and you know i pull on my hair but this is just a quick alternative if your hair does get a little bit old I make a ponytail in the back um, and I use my swirly curly snap hair ties and I just snap that right in place. Mm -hmm. And then I like to just stretch it out a bit to give it some height and then I add a headband and the look is just there, okay? So if you are thinking about an alternative like Janae, my hair is getting old or I messed it up, I don't wanna wash it just yet. Here's an alternative style to do if you are wondering. But yeah, girl, so this is basically the end of the video. We made it, uh-huh. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you learned something from it. Let me know down below, girl. But yeah, girl, uh-huh. I hope you found this video educating, a little entertaining. Let your girl know by giving a thumbs up. And girl, subscribe to the channel. Join my beautiful people crew, Woody Woo. And girl, as always, I thank you for watching and I'll talk to you later. Peace, 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 peace.